What great way to start this video by doing some farming. Yes. Look at all this wheat we now have. This is perfect. This is just what I need, and I'm going to need it today. And I'll explain why very soon. Although we're not actually going to need that much. But yes, hello everyone, Fudgy here, and welcome to episode three of Fudgecraft. Thanks so much for all the support on the previous two episodes. Like, I am learning so much from the comment section, and I really appreciate everyone that leaves me tips and advice. Now, one of the things that I learned recently from you guys is this. Let me show you. So, in the previous episode, we killed some pillagers, right? And I also asked you about the icon in the top right. Well, I figured out how to get rid of it. You can either drink milk, which I didn't do, um, or it just goes by itself. Because I'll be honest, I've been getting a little bit carried away with this game. And I've been playing it quite a bit off camera. So hopefully that's not too big of a problem. Um, I just got really carried away and <laughs> I'm sorry. But what I want to show you right now is uh, what we can do with the shield. So if we put this here, look what we can make. We can add a banner to the shield. Now, apparently by adding this, it means the pillagers will be scared of me. I'm not 100% sure if that's true or not, but if that's the case, that's pretty cool. So let's do it right now. So thank you for leaving that comment. Um, I actually saw quite a few comments saying that I should do this. Um, and yeah, there we go. <laughs> cool. We have a banner on our shield. Now, of course, we could get custom banners um, on the shield. You know, we could change it if we wanted to. And we could also, you know, have a, a custom one right here, which... Hopefully, I will very soon because I did actually make a loom, which, of course, is used to make the custom banners and whatnot. Um, oh, yes. And the mine, of course. This is the other thing I did. I added stairs. So now we can get down there nice and quickly and back up. But what I want to do right now is build the nether portal because um, there's some stuff I need to do. Basically, in this episode, I want to build a cow farm. Um, yeah, that's it. An automatic cow farm, I should mention. And we need to go to the nether to get, I think it's, uh, nether quartz. So yeah, we need nether quartz for what I plan on building. Um, and you're probably wondering, why is there a hole here? And that's where there's going to be like a glass tunnel leading through. That's my plan. I've also increased the sugar cane size and added this little trap door with a spy hole. Look at that. <laughs> it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, that is pretty much all I've done off camera. Not a crazy amount. Hopefully it's okay. I did do a little bit of mining and did get some uh, lapis and obsidian, as you can see. Nothing too crazy. Um, but yeah, it did take a little while. So First thing I want to do is make a flint and steel, and we do that by getting some flint and some steel. Now, pretty sure we have some flint in here, which we do, and it's very easy to make, of course. Oh, wait, we don't have any iron. Um, yes, give me that and pop you there. What is that? Iron nugget. We don't need that right now. Flint and steel. Boom. Now, as you all probably know, the nether portal... It's pretty loud, and I am not a huge fan of how it sounds. So what I've decided to do is build it here. That way, hopefully, we won't be able to hear it from where we are. Now, there is a way of making it so you can, like, switch it on and off. But I'm just going to have it on the entire time and um, have it further away. So I don't have to put up with the noises it's making. So, yeah, we're going to build it right here, I think. Now, I really need to get myself a farm up and running Pretty much because I want to get unlimited food. And is it... Wait, is this how you build it? I forget now. So is it two blocks or three blocks? I'm pretty sure it's three blocks. I don't think it matters too much, though. I really don't want to have to pick this stuff up. It takes a little while. Oh, no, this looks wrong. <gasps> Ooh, is that wrong? I feel like it looks weird. It's a square. Usually it's a rectangle, right? You know what? Doesn't matter. We'll fix it another day if it needs fixing. I don't know. Um, the important thing is hopefully we can get to the nether now. Once we've dropped off all my stuff, then we can head over into the nether. And what's weird about me heading to the nether is when I think about it, I haven't been to the nether in literally years. So kind of scary stuff for me. It shouldn't be a long journey. I also discovered that you can jump on beds today. Look at that. I didn't actually know that they are bouncy. Pretty cool. Anyway, let's go to sleep. All right, let's just go. I probably don't have everything I need. Actually, it would be probably a good idea to bring some water, right? There's going to be a lot of lava there, so we have to be pretty careful. I think the water might just disappear once we arrive. All right, let's do it. 
Let's go. I haven't been here for a long time, and I am terrified. Here we go. Okay. Hopefully, we don't get, like, destroyed straight away. Oh. Hey. Here we are. The never. I have returned. And this is the stuff that I need, I'm pretty sure. Is it? Is this never quartz? It is right. Yeah, there we go. Wow, that was easy. That's all I need. <laughs> so, we can probably head back now. I don't think we even need that much, to be honest. So, yeah. Let's just grab a little more. And then we're going to head back into the portal. And hopefully, by the end of this episode, I will have an automatic cow farm. The hardest part about this is probably going to be getting the cows into, like, my machine to begin with. It sounds real strange. The person who made the tutorial for this cow farm is called Hardner, I believe. So, um, I'll leave a link below. Oh, look! We have some more pillagers over there. Don't worry, I'll take them out if I need to. Okay, so let's just drop this. Go back inside, and I think we might... We, e we can either build it now. By the way, these are the stuff we're going to need, so I've been putting them at the bottom here. We can either make it now, or we need to use the furnace. I'm not too sure. What happens if we do put some in the furnace, actually? Nothing. Okay, that's fine. This is what I need, an observer. So this is what I wanted from the beginning, and we have everything we need now. So we are ready... To do this. That's awesome. Okay, hang on a minute. Where is it? There. Observer. Nice. And now we have just about everything to be able to do this. There's only one more thing I need. And I thought I had it, but I don't apparently. Uh, but that's lava. So we need to drop a bucket off. Let me put this inside since we're not going to need that. All right, there we go. Empty the buckets. And let's go find some lava. Yes. I love playing this game at the moment. Literally... Um, as I expected, it is eating away at my life at the moment. <laughs> I get so carried away with this game. It's insane, but it's just it's so much fun to play. Okay, actually, let's go lower down because I know for a fact that there's lava down here. And yes, I put a door there. Look at all this lava, all this juicy, juicy lava. Um, what am I doing again? Oh, yeah, let's put a bucket there. I've got to be very careful now. I don't want to die. Uh, can we pick up like that? Yes, we can. Uh, it just makes kind of that, but it's not an issue. Right. Now that we have this, we are good to go. Might as well get some iron while we're here and make a little window. Why not? But yeah, I know some of you probably want me to do some more building. And don't worry, I will very soon. I'm just kind of a little bit preoccupied uh, with some other stuff right now, as you can probably tell. But we will get around to building some epic stuff. And of course, adding to the house. Um, now, the question is... Where do I build this? Again, cows can be kind of loud, and I want them away from my base. I, you know, I don't want to have to listen to them all the time. So, um, yeah, we don't want them too close. Let's go ahead, grab the stuff we need. So, hopper, two dispensers, an observer, uh, signs, redstone, water, and an oak button. In fact, we're going to need one more oak button. Okay, and now I'm pretty sure we have everything. Actually, no, there's one more thing. One <laughs> more thing, and that is a redstone repeater. What do we need? Oh, never quartz for that as well. Oh, there we go. So, good thing I picked up some more. <sighs> and now we wait. While we wait for the stone, I do want to quickly say, if you do want to keep up with this series, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. I plan on making many more episodes, so uh, stay tuned. Oh, there we go. Free. And now we can make it. Okay, we're done. We did it. We have everything we need to do this apart from glass but now we do okay now i know there's some cows in this direction over here so it might be a good idea to build it over here along with the nether portal so yeah we don't want it too far though it also cooks the meat straight away as well so that's always nice i feel like this is quite a random spot for it but i am actually going to build it right here and i just ran out great there goes my shovel don't worry, I got a new one. We're all good. We're good to go. But yeah, the reason I want to do this location is because I'm pretty sure there's cows around here. So we should be able to get them in nice and easily. Um, I'm also going to make this out of cobblestone, which I forgot. So back we go. And we might as well sleep since it's uh, turning nighttime. So let's do that real quick too. Morning Minecraft. You know what? I am going to make some breakfast real quick. We're going to murder some of these fishes right here. There we go. This is going to be... My breakfast for the morning. Some salmon. Lovely stuff. Come here, buddy. Give me your meat. Yes. All right. How much? Whoa, that was weird. Hang on a minute. Let me go back in there. Let's see what it looks like. Whoa. Weird. Anyway, uh, we have four now. 
So we're going to head over to the campfire, cook them up, and then actually start with the cow farm. Here we go. Salmon is now cooking. Oh, beautiful. Nice. Uh, I'm not actually hungry right now, but it's good to have them anyway. So let's just chill and wait for them to cook, and then we can eat them later. Again, if you guys have suggestions for the house, do let me know in the comment section down below. Right now, to me, it's looking kind of plain, and I'm not even too sure if I like the roof at the moment. Like, I don't know. Does it stick out too much? I... I'm not sure about it. Maybe when I extend it out, it'll look better. Oh, there we go. My salmon's ready. Good stuff. All right. Let's go build this thing. I've actually decided to use stone bricks, but let's just do this. So you can follow uh, what I do if you want to build this yourself. Uh, but I highly recommend you watch the tutorial that I watched. It's, you know, pretty straightforward. It seemed very easy, and that's why I liked it. And hopefully it actually does work. Let's remove this tree real quick, too. Goodbye, tree. You're in my way a little bit, so you aren't going to have to get removed. Uh, also, this tree. Clear the area a little bit. Tidy it up. Right now, we're going to go up by, I think, is it three? Maybe four, actually. So now we place the hopper right here. Then we get a chest right in front of it. Place a sign right here. Don't need to put anything on it unless you do. Oh, let's put something on it. Yeah. Then we put a dispenser in here. Yep. I've got some, like, reference pictures here, so I can just follow that nice and easy. Scary sounds again. I think it's because I'm above the, uh, the mine, which is why those noises are playing. Very creepy, though. Button goes there. Very nice. Another one behind here. Can we put one there? Oh, we'll put it there. Oh, yeah, by the way, I put moo. Sorry, cows. Right, let's get the glass. Put it around here. I think that's how it goes. Yep. Right, I've just realized I made the wrong thing. I didn't make a redstone repeater. What did I build? Comparator. My bad. All right. It's daytime again. It was turning nighttime. Now we're all good. Um, I just need to go in here and get some more of this. And now we should be able to make a redstone repeater. The thing I initially wanted to build, not this one right here. Right, ladies and gentlemen, it is complete. I hope, anyway. So if we press this button, as you see, lava comes out. And this button, we get water. And the water is just so the cows actually lift up. And that way we can actually just breed them. Now, we actually have wheat on us, so we are good to go. All we need to do now is trap the cows inside. And that's it. We're good to go. Well, we need to breed them after that. But yeah, we're going to have an automatic cow farm, pretty much. And we'll be able to get food really really quickly now the hard part i mean this isn't really the difficult part but we do need to get the cows in there and it's probably going to be more time consuming than anything and i'm a little bit worried that we're not going to find any cows i still need to build a map as well well make one so that way i can return home without having to look at the smoke which is just there um why am i not finding cows like i honestly haven't seen a cow in quite a while. Eventually, I will get other farms going as well. It's not just going to be cows. But right now, the reason I want to build this is because, of course, I need food. And it's important that we have a resource for food. You know, we could make bread and everything like that. But an automatic cow farm is pretty cool. And this chicken is about to die. Where are all the cows at? <laughs> Where are the cows? Why is there none round here? It's kind of a uh, very harsh contraption that I've built today, you know. They literally get bred in this tiny area for them just to be burnt alive by lava and then cooked. It's pretty, pretty gruesome. <gasps> A cow. Another one. Yes. Cows, follow me. Um, I don't want the pigs to follow me, but they probably will anyway. Pigs like wheat? I don't think they do, actually. Okay. Actually, you stay here, cow. I need to get your buddy. Now, in the tutorial, he said that I need 24 cows. I don't know how I'm going to get 24 cows in there. Surely I could just keep breeding them? I don't know. All right, anyway, we've got this fella. What I could do, though, is build, like, a, a cow pen and breed them there. And then once I get to the number that I need, I can push them into the contraption. All right, there we go. Two cows. Hey, follow me. This is definitely the best way of doing it, right? No, cow. <laughs> Come here. That's it. That's it. All right, we're good. We're good. How far have we got to go? Where's the smoke? I do not see the smoke. Hopefully we're close. Oh, another cow. Yes. Hello. Oh, he's right next to my house as well. I didn't know that. Three cows. Not bad. Oh, no, 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 no. Go the other way. <laughs> Go the other way. We do not want to fall. Not today. Right. Are they still following? Yep. 
Free cows. That's good. Okay, we're going to have to remove these. I'm sorry. But they're going to have to go. Otherwise, they're probably going to end up injuring the cows. Oh, they're so slow in the water. <laughs> Why didn't I build a bridge? There we go. All right. Cows, your fate awaits. Follow me. And this is where you shall die. All right. Are they going to just fall in themselves? Oh. Wait, how do we get them in? Can we shove them inside the hole? I'm expecting them just to fall in eventually. Come on. He's right on it. Wait. Oh, no. Don't tell me. Have I missed a step? Did I miss a step? This is a complete mess this episode. What a disaster. <laughs> Come on. Get in the hole. Oh, no. All right, let's just move all this stuff. And hopefully one of them will... Oh, come on. You there, you. You're going to be the first cow. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. You're home. No, you, no, stay. No, 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 no. Oh, they're too smart. They're too smart. Okay, okay. We did it. We got two inside now. That's all we need, right? That's all we need. Right, I'll tell you what. What we're going to do is we are going to make a very temporary little pen for the cows to breed. I think it might be a good idea. So let's build that over here somewhere. Oh, no, no. Zombies, stay back. I'm trying to murder some cows here. Leave me be. All right, we got him. Nope, cow, cow. Stay close. Oh, this has been... I feel like I haven't really been able to get much done in this episode, but it's been quite fun building this. I just really want to get it up and running. I'm going to go sleep, and then I'm going to hopefully find another cow. That's the plan. In fact, let's just get you guys loved up, shall we? Hey, an achievement! And a baby cow ready to be slaughtered. I'm sorry. Kind of need to... Oh, I said I was going to eat the salmon. That's right. I was going to say I need to eat something. Oh, I've got like half a bar. I need to like stop eating when I don't need to really. Hey, I've just found another cow. My eyes hurt from playing Minecraft too much. <gasps> oh, I heard another cow. Yes. Where is he? I, I definitely just heard another cow. No. Yeah, there's got to be another one. Where is he? Is he in here? Oh, you stay here, buddy. Hang on. Give me one second. Oh, he is. I knew I heard another one. Yeah. Hey, buddy, I saved you, and now I'm going to kill you. This way, come on. <laughs> this is so good. Everyone, get inside and breed. That's it. Yes, breed. Let's see the baby. There it is. It's beautiful. Yes, hello. Welcome to the world. <laughs> um, right. That's it. We can't breed much more. Can we breed these guys again? Or is it... Yeah, okay, we can't breed them just yet, but look at that. We got some cows now, which is good. You know what? I'm going to get them out because I think it's just going to make things complicated, you know, when it comes to uh, getting them inside. So we'll get them out first, put them in the pen, and then we'll put them in the trap. Oh, there we go. Yes, we've done it again. Awesome. All the cows are in the pen now. Right, you know what? I'm going to build a real quick bridge going to the other side. And it's going to be a diagonal bridge. So this might be kind of awkward to do. But we're doing it anyway. It's going to be a very basic bridge to begin with. You know, I might do some... Oh, no. I might do some improvements uh, another time. But it's mainly, of course, just so I don't have to swim across every single time. And it might be good for also transporting some animals if I need to, because they are very slow at swimming, especially cows. Now, I know a lot of you want to see the contraption in action and want to see some cows die and then me get the food pretty much instantly. However, I need to breed some more, get the numbers up, and then I can actually breed them in the actual trap itself. Um, and yeah, we should pretty much have unlimited food by then. Now, unfortunately, it's going to take a little while to breed them. So what I'm going to do is end this episode right here. And hopefully in the next one, you'll be able to see it in action. So I really hope you all enjoyed. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye.